Folks, welcome to the stream of the year. This is the stream. You might not know this but if you're a new viewer here, but Chibi Robo has a history, has a history on the Beta 64 live streams. We have completed Chibi Robo 1 on the Nintendo GameCube. We have completed Chibi Robo Clean Sweep Super Rich Mega Cleaning Game otherwise known as Chibi Robo 2, even though it's the third game, but it's like the sequel to the story. That game, 100%ed on Switch. Where's your Walmart uniform? And today, we're going to be doing something extra special. That's right, we're going to be playing the Walmart exclusive video game known as Chibi Robo Park Patrol. This ain't no fan translation. This is a real video game that released in English, in America, only at Walmart. And then I think it like released elsewhere too. I'm pretty sure that like, this was not always Walmart exclusive because you can find ones with like the Walmart logo. Here, I'll show you. Here, let me let me just move that down. There's like Chibi Robo Park Patrol. I'm gonna like I'm too lazy to like download all the images. I'm just gonna show you my web browser. Usually I'd be nervous about that, but nothing weird could pop up with Chibi Robo. Okay, so like if you look at the box art of Chibi Robo Park Patrol, some of them don't have the Walmart logo on the top left, like this one. There ain't no, there ain't no Walmart logo, but then ones like this, it has only at Walmart. So I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure that it wasn't always a Walmart exclusive game. And it was just like at first, like maybe like, I don't know, a year exclusive. I don't friggin' know. And it, it could be a sticker for all I know. I don't friggin' know. But that's all to say, welcome to Walmart. How may I help you this day? X the drone, welcome into the stream. I also saw a new viewer that I don't know what their name is now, but welcome as well. Mega, thank you for the 50 bits. Mihi Chow, monthly. thank you for the monthly sub with Prime Gaming for nine freaking months. How do you not know? Do you not own the game legally? So I'm gonna be playing the game on the Wii U. I'm gonna be playing the game on the Wii U. Because there is no better way to play a DS game in this day and age than on the Wii U. It is like the number one way to do it. It is uh, is the crispiest. I mean, it doesn't completely work sometimes. We had some problems with the last Chibi Robo game. But most of the time, it's the best. Because you're not going to be playing these DS touchscreen games on a freaking emulator. And then you're gonna use your like dang little mouse cursor. You look like a little nerd with your mouse cursor, trying to trying to do something like that. No, 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 no. The only oh yeah, chat did die. Why did chat die? Where did chat? Did that was the weirdest thing I've ever seen. I clicked back in OBS's window and it just came back. That was so weird. Okay, chillax. Welcome in. I've got my Wii U all set up. I'm going to take off my uniform right now. Yeah. Long day of work. Just gonna put that uniform to the side. Perfect. There's totally not gonna be a jump scares crash in this game. No, 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 no. That was just the last game. That was just the last game. This time, there's. I've been told it is perfect. There's gonna be no problems whatsoever. You can you can clip that and use it later if you need to. But there should be absolutely zero issues as we play through this game that I have absolutely zero clue anything about nothing not one single solitary thing do i know about chibi robo park patrol oh oh yeah is that crispy oh yeah here's blurry here's crispy i prefer crispy it's not as much of a banger as the, as the other game so you i've been told that park patrol 
is like kind of like I don't know. Do you know like how Catherine is like the precursor to Persona 5? This is like Catherine. And and Chibi Robo part uh clean sweep is Persona 5. You know what I mean? You feel me on? So like it uses the models in this game in the other game that we played. You might want to swap the screens, okay? This was the way that I had it last time, right? Or did I do this? What was the way I did it? Is this the way? I guess we'll find out. I think this was this was this was the way, right? This was the way we used to have it. I don't remember. I guess we'll find out. Bo. Because I'm pretty sure that the last game, the bottom screen was like the the main screen, but maybe it's not the case in this one. Oh, it's the it's the music it's the music from the TV show in the sec in the, in the, in the third game. Citrus Soft Robotics is committing to make a difference in people's life. As the premier name in home robotics, we are proud to unveil our latest innovation. Yo, GV, happy 17th anniversary of me. Oh, that's your birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Please give me a warm welcome to the newest member of the Citrusoft Robotics family. Blooming Chibi Robo. This tiny robot is just four inches tall, but even more powerful than ever before. Let's take a look at some of the improvements as it rolls off the line. Come along. First off, this one is green. Ooh, look at those hands. That's... I don't know, the way that they look, they look like... They look like each finger got, like, a bee sting on it. Yes, we hand make and torture every Chibi Robo before we're done. That's the real Chibi Robo. That's the real one. That's the real one. Oh, him. Let's stop this putting my fishing touches on my blooming Chibi Robo prototype. As you can imagine, I'm very excited. He's beautiful in every way. Hello there, little one. I'm very pleased to make your acquaintance. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Dr. Duke Harold of the Citrusoft Robotics, and guess what? I'm going to kill you. You are a flower blooming model. You know, I'm a bit of a bloomer myself. Did you know? It's not too late to join the beta bloomers on Pikmin Bloom. If anyone like wants a link to that, I can just shove it in chat. I can just shove it in chat. You should be very proud. You've tasked you with an important mission. You see, pollution is a major problem worldwide, and green places are going gray, and its flowers are vanishing. It's a terrible shame, and we're the ones who caused it. And that's why I invented you, to do the hard work for me. Well then, it's time for your first test. Listen carefully, I will not repeat myself. You'll be using your boombox and squirter that's the squirter from the st from the last game. That's the squirter from the last game. Does that imply there are multiple Chibiros? Yeah, every game you're, there are tons of Chibiros in the world, but you're the best. You're the best. Right over there is to make flowers and produce seeds, and then the squirter will spray the bloods and grow them into flowers. Let's get started. See that flower over there? No, I don't. There's at least one million. According to the last games, there's at least one million. Can you get it to produce even more flowers? Oh shoot, we're starting. How do we, how do I play? Oh, what in the, you, you, you don't use the touch screen in this one? That's so, okay, the, the, what? No, do you use the touch screen? Oh, okay, okay, kind of. You kind of use the touchscreen. So you walk like this, and then you tap to... Oh, that's so weird. That's so weird. So you tap to pick it up. Why wouldn't you just use the A button? Why wouldn't you just use the A button? It's a little bit different than I'm used to. But, you know, you know, it's Chibi Robo. I can, I can make an exception here. So do I squirt you, or do I boombox you? Play a catchy tune by spinning the spool of tape with good timing. Oh yeah. Amazing, amazing, that, that was really good. That was really good. 
It's because the touchscreen's cool. That was literally perfect. I, I, I'm, I'm a god at this game. Why does the flower look possessed? That is the flower from the last game. Oh, and I even got happy points. I even got happy points. So you have to like, squ you have to beat it up. You have to punch it in the face with your squirter. Good job, little one. You earned happy points. So I don't know what this game is. I just want to make sure you're aware of that. I have no idea what this game is and if there's any gambling in it. I would love to know if there was gambling in this game. That would be that would be fantastic. This new model is amazing. You're a smart little robot. And you probably already know this, but here's a tip. The white flowers produce seeds when you play music. However, color flowers won't produce seeds no matter what you do. You got all that? Your answer with the... Sure. Yeah, I got that. Sure, 100%. I totally got that. Could you imagine an auction house to buy stuff for your park? So is this like... Is this a farming sim? I'm sure you'll be just fine once you leave here. I have to say, though, I will miss you. Terribly. But the world needs you, Chibi Robo. Just do your best. Good luck. Chibi Robo's guarding capabilities is a green answer to pollution epidemic. He can turn barren, polluted areas into lush fields of flowers. And like all models, this Chibi Robo is equipped with patented happiness generating technology. <gasps> it's, the, it's the house from the, from the other game. I keep saying second game. I'm just going to say the third game. And that's not all. To commemorate the blockbuster sales of the original Chibi Robo model, we have a very exciting offer. As part of our strong commitment to a cleaner, greener environment, we will be providing Chibi Robos to the parks all over the world. For free! For free Chibi Robo! And naturally, Sister Soft will cover the shipping as well. Yes, we're serious. That That's actually insane. I would 100% grab one. This game makes me wish Chibi Robo was real. I don't mind cleaning the house. I actually really enjoy cleaning the house. I I like I like uh you know chores. They 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 center me. They ground me. But if I had a little tiny robot that did it all for me, then I, yeah, of course I'd do it. Of course I'd do it. My feeling when Roombas exist. I, I have a Roomba. It's wonderful. It's fantastic. It's freaking amazing. But imagine it with a Chibi Robo though, a cute little guy. That'll also listen you talk about your recent divorce. I, 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 I'm not saying I went through a divorce. I'm trying to. I'm saying that that's what in the games. The games they go through divorces. I, I'm not. It's yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. We're about to freaking get going. I need my Roomba to accidentally get its head hit with a giant pie pan. Wait. What's this weird box doing here? That's literally the voice of uh of Carl. No, not Carl. Who who's what's the kid's name? Is his name just Kid? Is his name just Kid? Weezer? No, it's Keith. It's not Weezer. It's not Weezer. Look at this gross park. It's not that gross actually. It actually looks kind of nice. It's nice and green and lush. There's no way I'm hanging out here. What a dump. You know, I made a game exactly like this for a college class. It was called Cock Adventure. Cox Adventure. Cox Adventure was what it was called. And, uh... Who's this? This ain't no telly. This ain't no telly. Who are you? It's one of those Otoma phones. Good morning, Chibi Robo. Alrighty then. Let's turn those happy points into watts. Do I dare give this this thing the same voice as Telly? Do I dare? I don't trust him. I don't trust him. Let's recharge next. You're fully charged now. You have 21 to live reserve. You life served to me. I'm just gonna do it the other. I'm sorry. I'm gonna. I'm gonna have to. I can't. I can't do anything else. Your new life starts today, Chibi Robo. Aren't you just bursting with excitement? Oh, uh, oh, I totally forgot to introduce myself. How embarrassing. Please excuse me. My name is Chet. <laughs> it's very nice to meet you. Hey, Chet. I'm looking forward to working with you. This park isn't much to look at today, it's true. But from what I hear... 
Was this Chibi Robo a bit? No, no, no. See, they're helping create a greener Earth by throwing uh, trash into every park in the world. And then it'll figure out itself. Chet isn't whimsical, but he did go, oh, he did do that. It used to be the most beautiful place. There was a lush carpet of green grass, and there was carpet everywhere. It was amazing. And, of course, there were lovely flowers covering every square inch of it. Is that Chet from Despicable Me 4? Yes, of course. Yeah, of course. Yeah. But nowadays, things are pretty different. Not even the townsfolk... I thought that was a fart sound. Not even the townsfolk make their way here anymore. It's just not right. We've got to fix this park up like it used to be. So, step one, let's get some flowers blooming. Bloomer. I'm a bloomer. Let's see. There are three flowers in the park right now. Why don't you try for 20 flowers? I know you can do a chibi roll. But first, let's get the chibi gear section of the chibi PC. Oh, but not for business. Uh, oh, I almost forgot. Since you're on electricity, uh, be sure to keep your battery full. I do love that even when it's not telly, they still go, oh, every time. Every time. If you let your battery drop down to zero watts, then, well, you're dead. So come back to the chibi house often for a recharge and say hi. By the way, would you like to say I would love to say thank you so much. I would love to. What are his specs? Uh, I think he's got a uh, Pentium 2? A Pentium 2 processor? Time to blanket that park with flowers. So let's go. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm curious, like, if there's going to be, like, a whole farming sim aspect. I keep thinking that I'm going to tap the screen to move. I keep, I keep thinking that that's what I'm supposed to do. Uh-oh. I almost forgot. I'm so sorry, but I can't join you. Not to be mysterious, but I have reasons. But there's good news, too. Our visual and auditory capabilities are connected. That means I can look through your eyes and hear what you hear. We are always together. <gasps> Why are you looking at me like that? You think I'm lying? Go out there and see for yourself. He's wanted by the law. All right, we have 24 hours in order to make this park amazing. Uh, do you copy? No, I don't. Sorry, I don't copy. It's me, Chet. Phew, don't scare me like that ever again, or you'll regret it. I'm so glad we can keep in touch this way. Alrighty then. So let's go. I honestly do miss Telly. He's my favorite character. He's he's even in the, the spinoff games, too. All the other spinoff games. You know what I need to do? I really need to finish Photo Finder. Yeah, that, no, that was great. What are you talking about? That was fantastic. Wait, I'm, 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 bro, I'm going to run out of battery just trying to do this. There we go, 100%. There we go. And now I gotta go squirt all the flowers. Chibi Robo has a certain quirkiness that I admire. Chibi Robo is one of my favorite game series, and I swear to you, I'm going to finish Chibi Robo Ziplash, even if it means I have to spend my personal time doing it. Even if it means I have to sit there on my 3DS every night, every single night, playing Chibi Robo Ziplash. I don't care. I want to be the first person in the entire world to ever 100% complete every single Chibi Robo game of all time. I know I'm going to run out of battery, but it's worth it for my park. It's worth it for the park. Okay, we're, okay, we're heading back. We're heading back. Any plans on playing the spiritual successor when it comes out? I'm going to wait to see if it ever does first we're gonna we're, we're gonna see we're gonna see i mean i think it's already been funded i'm not saying that i mean more of the fact of uh you know yeah i mean it might come out in seven years for all i know it's it's a kickstarter campaign you know what i mean welcome back chibi robo do you want to convert happy points to watts i would love to thank you you still need 100 percent the first game how insane is it to 100 percent chibi robo on the gamecube like like how how hard are we talking here Mighty number nine be like. It's just I don't I don't I don't have a lot of faith in Kickstarter campaigns these days. When's the last like really successful one? 
Because there was a uh, Shovel Knight, which is absolutely mind-blowingly wonderful and beautiful. But I can't think of any other ones. Undertale was a Kickstarter campaign? Really? No, Super Mario Brothers 3? <laughs> Let me check the Chibi Gear section of the Chibi Robo PC. Uh, looks like the next shipment will arrive when you up your counter by 10. I would love to save already. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. System Shock remake was. I did hear good things about that. I did hear good things. Maybe I'm being overcautious, but uh, you know, I just I don't want to I don't want to I don't want to be disappointed and be like oh yeah, 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 yeah. And, and and like like you know I don't want to be disappointed. I'm keeping my expectations nice and small, nice and small. Can you please play Fortnite? I have played Fortnite twice actually. And it is on the Archive channel, if you would like to watch it. If Peter Griffin was in uh, in Chibi Robo or, or Co Robo or whatever it's called, if, if, if he was in that, then I would consider playing it. I would, I would definitely consider playing it if, if, if Peter Griffin was the dad in Chibi Robo. That would be pretty fun, wouldn't it? Yeah. No, it's not funny. That's not funny, Andrew. It's not funny. Okay, the white flowers are the ones that actually produce seeds, so I need to I need to do this. Okay, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. That was 82. That's still pretty good. That's... Oh, don't click the reset button. Don't click the reset button. Oh, what? It turned into like a... It's like a multicolored one. Oh, dude. I'm getting like... I'm getting like a ton of happy points out of that. He almost quit again. So, I'm assuming that this is like, you know, the intro and not going to be the entirety of the game. Right? <laughs> it's not going to only be... It's like, oh, well, you know, man, you gotta, you gotta plant flowers, and and that's uh, that's that's the whole thing. That's the whole video game. Surely, there's more to it. This reminds me of Pikmin for some reason. I don't, I don't think this reminds me of anything personally. Like, I can't think of a single other game that's like like this. You know what I mean? Should we tell him? That, that, that can't be the entire game. It can't be. It can't be the entire game. There is more. Okay, okay, okay. I don't want to be spoiled at all. This is, this is going to be a spoiler-free journey. The good thing about Chibi Robo Clean Sweep is that no one knew, myself included, no one freaking knew what that game was. So we were able to, like, experience it together. You know what I mean? Was that so fun? Was that so fun? We had no freaking clue what was going on. And it was like, oh yeah, oh yeah, he's just dead. Oh yeah, 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 the demons, uh, of course, from hell. Yeah, of course they come and hang out with you. Yeah, of course that's what you need to do. You need to re the, reanimate the dead. Yeah, of course there's a casino. Like, it was such an interesting story. My thing about... uh the new Chibi Robo, the Co Robo Kickstarter. Does anyone know if the writer of the Chibi Robo games, the writer of the Chibi Robo games, is is working on it too? That is that is my question. Cause like I know that the the character artist is the original character artist, but I'm curious. Uh, you know the writing of Chibi Robo is where 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 the, where the craziness is. What is that? I don't I don't know what that is. I guess we'll find out later. That's like a multicolored flower for some reason. And then there's like pixels down. Let's just see what, what that is. No, no, no. I should focus on the flowers first. I should focus on the flowers because I just need 20 and then I can unlock the new thing. It's harder than you think. I swear, it's harder than you think. There we go. So I don't think there's actually like a uh, a certain speed you have to go. It's just whatever speed you start with, you have to keep that speed. I think that's the way that it works. 
So like, if you start super fast, then you have to keep going super fast. So as long as you just keep a constant speed, then it's not it's not that hard until until you you mess up like I do, and then and then you suck, and then you embarrass yourself in front of everybody. I loved it when the ghost mafia boss came to steal our souls and crash the game. <laughs> that game ruled, dude. I wish, I wish with all of my heart and mind that Chibi Robo gets a remake. It's gonna happen, right? If every single game on the face of the planet has been able to get a remake, every single game, good, bad, doesn't matter. There isn't a single video game that has not gotten a remake. Now, granted, it would be a little weird to do it without the touchscreen, but they'd figure out a way. They'll figure out a way. You know what I mean? Hey, Beta Man. I used to watch the stream like a year ago and was inspired, was inspired to return to binging Tomodachi Life VODs. Oh. There's a lot of them. There's a lot of them. I'm pretty sure we've done, like, tons of, of Tomodachi Life, right? Like, 15 parts? 15 parts of Tomodachi Life? Let's go. 21. Your flower count has gone to 21. Oh, wowie zowie. What is it with wowie zowie? I never heard of wowie zowie before. And then once Super Mario Wonder did it, I just like all these games I'm seeing like, oh yeah, wowie zowie. Yeah, of course. That's in every single video game ever. Oh, wowie zowie. I love wowie zowie. Get a load of this. The chibi gear section is now open for business. You can spend your watts on all sorts of nifty stuffs. Take a look at the chibi gear section of the Robo PC. Oh, ooh, I could use a new battery. I could use it. You won't have to recharge so often. Yippee, I'm so excited, I'm gonna die. Let me check when the next item is scheduled to arrive. Looks like the next shipment will uh, arrive when your count is 19. By the way, I would love to save. Thank you. My first exposure to Wowie Zowie was an old kid's cartoon and then Luigi's Mansion 3 had it. I didn't even know Luigi's Mansion 3 had it. I had no idea. Okay. I thought it just said, let's explode. And I, and I was like, oh, okay. This is game over. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what's on the chibi PC. What do we got here? Okay, that's a little difficult to read, but I'm going to do my best. Okay. Chibi gear. Oh, park projects forecast stickers. Let's do this. Get the chibi gear. Got that watt battery. How much is that? How much is that? You need more. Oh, you can't. There's no money in here. You have to get enough energy to pay for it in your reserves. I see. So I need 990 in my reserves, and I currently have 175. Because it's not about money in this game. It's about. Oh, there's an actual day night cycle. It's not about money in this game. It's about making the world a better, greener place. That's what it's all about. I do actually think it's funny that uh they made like this game it's just like a nice happy protect the environment make a nice park people are gonna be so happy and then like the next game they make is just like get rich get insane money go gamble your finances away just kill somebody i don't know it's um it's great it's amazing i love chibi robo 3 Nice, 100%. Very nice. You know, just letting you know, I, would, I, would, I was the first person to tell kids to go gambling. <laughs> and, then, and then it became all popular because of that flip note. But I was, you know, I was the original. <laughs> I've, been doing, I've been doing gambling mar marble screams for years. I was the original. That's uh, maybe not something I should be proud of. <laughs> but, you know, whatever. I think this game didn't have a full team on it. So this this was like the the smaller team. So I, my question is, when did this come out? When did this when did this come out? Compared to like uh the 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 clean sweep game, what was what was the difference? Get a proud gambler T-shirt. <laughs> Two thousand and for some reason I thought nineteen ninety eight. That was not even close. So not even close. So this came out in 2007. When did uh, when did the next game come out? When did uh, when when did Chibi Robo Clean Sweep come out? Yeah, 1998. My favorite DS era of games. My favorite era. Two 
2009. So it was like three years. Or sorry, two years. That would be two years. Two years. That's not That's not very long. Welcome back, Chibi Robo. Do you want to convert your points? Yes, I would. So my question was, do you think that they made this game and the other game at the same time? That's my question. How much sleep did you get last night? Not very much. <laughs> not, not very much. I've been trying to get sleep these days, and it, it, it just gets harder every day. It gets harder every day. I used my nips for water, and you didn't even notice. I'm sorry. Here, allow me to make it up to you. How's that? Would you recommend the original Chibi Robo? Of course, 100%. 100% recommend it. With all of my heart, mind, and body. Maybe not body. We'll just do heart and mind. It is like, it is like absolutely incredible. Now, it, it's a weird game, right? So, like, I feel like people who like Chibi Robo, I, I don't know how to describe it other than you kind of like, it's like a puzzle game, but also like just relaxing cleaning game but then like some parts of it are hard I, I don't know was oh, that the end of the day are we done oh good job chibi but look at the time come on back you worked enough why don't you head back to the house kind of like pigman pigman is also weird you're right pigman is also weird Ooh, i don't know what the uh, the multicolor one is but I, I think that's rare i think i got a rare one i think i got a rare one Who? Hold on, I, my, my entire chest is completely covered in water. I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait for y'all to finish those waters. I'm gonna wait, I'm gonna wait for y'all to finish, but we're not continuing the game until you finish. We're not continuing the game until you finish. You're never gonna know who that exciting new character is until you stop. I forgot to put the limiter back on! Oh my gosh, I was wondering what was going on! I forgot to put the limiter back on! Alright, alright, limit, limit, uh, limit is, uh, uh, zero. You get zero. There is no more. <laughs> there is no more. I knew I forgot something! Oh, man! <laughs> okay, yep, no, no, you're done, you're done. You're done. No more water. Water's done. Water's gone forever. Why would you forget? I t okay, so you might be wondering why I turned it off. Uh, allow me to explain that I have 87 Sipskis to go. I've already drank... I've already drank around 75 Sipskis. I don't have that much water. I'm gonna have to pace myself, okay? I'm gonna have to pace myself, or else I'm gonna be peeing all freaking night. Don't call me a piss boy. Now I got Now I gotta skip all these little like squirt sounds that are happening. I have to like mash the skip alert button to get all the squirt sounds to go away, or else it's gonna be happening for the next like thirty minutes. That's so funny. So I turned off the Sipsky limiter in order to test to see if, like, like it's working. Like, so, for instance, I can't redeem any channel points unless, uh, 
I can't redeem any channel points unless the limiter has gone off stream. So I turn it off to test and then I need to remember to turn it back on and then I didn't. So we'll get to those 87 Sipskis later. Why don't we figure out what this guy's all about? Hmm. Do my eyes deceive me? Or are the ghastly little faces of flowers smiling up at me? The Sipski incident of 2024. It's, I'm dead. I'm going to die. I, that's it. That's it. This is the last stream of all time. And what is this? The foul metal contraption looks suspiciously helpful. Mm. I see. Just a pile of garbage. Sweet, sweet, light, choking garbage. Chibi Robo's mortal enemy. Good morning, Chibi Robo. I'm doomed, by the way. I, 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 I'm, I'm, com I'm completely doomed. This is not going to cover it. I'm going to have to get more water. I'm going to have to get more water. Let me check on the next term is uh, item is scheduled to arrive. Looks like the next shipment arrives when you're up to a flower count by 12. I'm going to tell you right now that uh, I have been severely dehydrated. So maybe this is, it's maybe, uh, maybe it's not so bad. Andrew, you say that like hydration is bad. Dude, my thing is, why do we need to drink water? Okay. I, I just feel like it's just like, like for nerds. I just don't feel like, like drinking water is really that helpful. I think, I think it's more of a nerdy thing to do personally. See, Andrew, we're helping you. We're helping you. I, I mean, technically, yes. Technically, yes. I'm going to be very hydrated. What do you mean, 47? Yeah, there we go. There we go. I'm offended. I'm a nerd, too. It's fine. We're all little. We're all a little nerdy inside. So when do I unlock the giant pickup truck? When do I when do I get a gigantic pickup truck to enjoy? Oh, the bridge is broken. Honestly, I could I could go for a gardening sim game. Why are you not growing? What? 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 Huh? What's happening? Chibi Robo, do you copy? Sand leaks essential nutrients that plants need to grow. That's why the flowers aren't growing. But do not worry. You see, all you need is the tiller cartridge. Then you can use the tiller and park project to turn sand into fertile soil. Who put sand in the park? Who put sand in the park? Wait, 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 what did I say? What did, what did I say? It lacks nutrients. What did, what did I say? Oh, I just know flowers love soil. You said leaks. Well, I just wasted a ton of battery on that. That would, what, what an utter waste. This game is Walmart pilled. <laughs> you should see the ground in Florida. Yeah, maybe, maybe that's the problem. Maybe that's the best. I, I mean, I, when I was in Oklahoma, the ground was rock. It was just like clay like hard clay i remember if the water hit the ground if the i can't move left oh now i can i guess i guess it, I, I lost sync what what is this whenever water hit the ground in oklahoma if you stepped on it your shoes were permanently stained forever for forever it was it was awful Okay, here's what I'm going to do. To get through these Sipskis, I'm going to drink 20 every time I, I recharge Chibi Robo. It's like we're recharging together. I'm going to plug in. <sighs> That's 20. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, 
14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Wow, only 68 to go. Only 68 to go. You know, of any stream to have this problem in, it should be this one. You know, it's all about being healthy. It's all about, you know, the environment, making sure that, like, like we're all growing. Make sure all the flowers are watered. Well, I'm a little flower, too. I'm a cute little flower that needs to be watered. So thank you for watering me. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. I would love to save again. Are you a Pikmin? What a sentence. Well, I'm going to tell you I'm going to tell you that uh it's a sentence that works. It's a sentence that just makes sense. You know what I mean? It's a sentence that makes sense. I appreciate you watering me and I'm cuz I'm a delicate little cute flower. <laughs> Sorry, that peaked the mic. Uh, okay, okay. Where's the... What happened to, like, all my seeds? I had, like, a ton of seeds that should have been planted. Yeah, 77 is fine. 77 is fine. Betas confirm pigment. Pigment don't drink water. Pigment, pigment are afraid of water. Pigment can't drink water. You know what? I agree. You are a delicate little flower. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there's one right here. They start getting harder to find once you once you once you have so many flowers. So there's one over here. Oh, music. There's actual music in this game. What happens if I like play the music in front of flowers that aren't white? One. Pikmin don't eat or drink. Pikmin don't eat, drink, or do anything. It's confirmed. It's it's confirmed. Miyamoto said. Miyamoto said that he doesn't he doesn't drink water, so neither should Pikmin. That's what he said in an interview. Okay. Where did my where did my other other little 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 cute little plants go they get like sent to like other patches of soil i think is what it is oh i'm i am i am almost out of battery i gotta try playing music in front of like the other the other flower kinds like the multicolor one because that one's rare that's a rare flower breed is there anything a pikmin can't have uh pikmin can't eat uh anything ever they can only have nectar. That's all they can have. Do flowers eat? They do, right? Do flowers eat? They have like photosynthesis and they've got like water, but they don't like eat anything. But there's like plant food. You can buy plant food. I don't know, I just never thought about that. I was like, oh, Pikmin are flowers, so they shouldn't eat anyway. I actually, I actually don't know how flowers work. I, re I remember, I remember studying it, and I just, I just didn't care. I just didn't care. I didn't want to learn about flowers and photosynthesis. I remember it was like they, they have like a, a shell and they like do stuff. That's all I remember. That's all I remember. Didn't, didn't you have a, a subject in school you just didn't care about? Mine was biology. All right, let's see if this does anything. Well, it's not going to do anything if I don't do good. There we go. 100%. It does absolutely gosh dang nothing. It does absolutely freaking nothing. Good to know. Good to know. Absolutely nothing. Andrew, please grow a plant and keep us updated so we know you haven't killed it yet. <laughs> wow, I just, I just, I just failed on that one completely. Wow, it, 
it's kind of hard every once in a while. Just randomly every once in a while. Okay, okay, there we go. I got, I got one. I got one. See, but every time you go in a house, you lose your buds. So I gotta like, I gotta like do this while I have a chance. There we go. Got it. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. So I could. That would actually be kind of cute, having like a little plant cam. And it's like you can redeem points to check. It's it's like check, check on plants, see if it's dead. I I haven't grown a lot of plants. It's more of like Nook's thing. She like she likes growing plants and and flowers and stuff like that. My mom growing up would her way of like planting flowers is she would take uh, seeds and throw them in the yard and then just whatever happens happens. I remember that. Why do you grow plants by dancing? That's what you always do. That's what I learned from Jimmy Neutron. There was that episode of Jimmy Neutron where uh, where they played like heavy metal music to a plant and danced and then it like grew to be like so big that it blew up the whole town. That's why I never dance in front of my flowers. Never. Okay, so I have 393. I need to get I need to get 990. The Mythbusters did that too. I could do a Mythbusters show. I could do I could do that on Andrew 64, my other ch my, my my second channel. I could do that. Be like, oh, I was spending 100 days playing Nintendo Switch with my Zania. Or is it Zinnia? It's Zinnia, isn't it? It's not Zadia. <laughs> it's Zinnia. 100 days playing heavy metal Splatoon music with my sunflowers. Do you have to get like a 100% to like get the Mac? There we go. There we go. Gardening stream when see the problem with that is I don't think I'd be able to grow an entire plant in two hours I think that would be a little bit of a a little bit of a, a a problem So like when we did the ice cream social the granny ice cream social uh, That was really pushing it because like it takes a long time to make ice cream that was pushing it I feel like doing gardening might push it over the edge just do bamboo. Oh, just bamboo grow in two hours? Baby, we, 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 yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Bamboo. Bamboo grows a few inches every day. Oh, I, I, I had no idea. I actually had no idea. Now I'm embarrassed because I was like, oh, you do to me. I was just being a smart guy. I was being a smart aleck. Being a brat. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. That was my bad. Okay, this one's going to be it. I'm going to, I'm going to hope that he brings me to the house because like the day should be almost over because I don't think I'm going to make it okay I don't think I'm going to make it I don't think I'm going to make it seven six five four three okay 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 we're fine we're fine we're fine everyone's fine no problem at all absolutely no problem whatsoever Trying to do 13 things at once because I'm trying to drink water at the same time. Too much for my little brain to do. <sighs> wow, that was a lot. That was that was a lot. Oh, look at that. Look at that go. Look at that go. So we got 695. And look at all these flowers. Look at all these beautiful, lovely flowers. Thank you for the 25 bits, Carly. Thank you. <gasps> Wowie Zowie! Chibi Robo, now that you have over 40 flowers, you get a load of this. Take a look at the Chibi Gear section. The clippers. <gasps> I can mow the grass. Yes! I've been asking about that on stream all the time. When are we going to be able to do a grass cutting stream? It's finally time. It's finally time for the grass cutting stream. Citrusoft hasn't confirmed a schedule yet. Oh, okay. So there's like, it's like buy this before you can actually continue with the game. You're so close to getting the battery, but now I want the shears. Now I want to get that. Now I want to get the clippers. 
How much are the clippers? How, how much? Are the, how much? How much was the clippers? You didn't read what the item actually is. I assume it just cuts the grass, right? I, I'm just, I'm just assuming here. And you know what they say about assuming? You're always right. <gasps> I can. Oh, never mind. That's not what it does at all. I can pick flowers. Sure, I'll buy it. Let's see. Let's see what happens. How many dang Sipskis are there? I think over a hundred. That's the most Sipskis I've ever had in my entire life. <laughs> in my entire life. So how does... How do the clippers work? Okay. Uh... Is this good? Is this bad? Am I doing something wrong? Am I doing something right? Is this is this good? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. Good job, Chibi. But look at the time. Come on back. Maybe maybe I I sell them and get millions of dollars. Good morning, Chibi. Chibi had a cute little flower pot head. He's so... He, I love Chibi Robo so much. He's perfect in every way. I guarantee you, by the end of 2020... What do you mean, oh dear? The flower count went down. Yeah, because I picked them. What am I supposed to do? I don't know how to get money from picking flowers. Uh, did I, did I do something bad? Is the game recommendation, recommendation nip reward gone? It, it's it's on pause because I had so many. It's on pause, but it, it will be back. It will return. Okay, so um, I don't know what to do with the flowers I I, I cut. It didn't tell me. Uh, the forecast is it gonna? Oh, can it rain? Can it rain? Today's forecast, there will be nighttime. Okay, that's good to know. That's 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 good to know. Are the clippers supposed to be just killing flowers to like make space or something like that? Is that what it's supposed to be? The the robot specifically said, "Oh, it's a great way to earn happy points." Okay, one second. For some reason, I need to like. Wait, it didn't do anything. It didn't do anything. Cake, though. Thank you for the Prime Gaming 38 month resub. Appreciate it, Cake. How how are you doing? How are you doing? Oh, that's a gold one. So my question is: is by clipping the flowers, I can get why it keeps them. They're in my head. What is the point? What is the point of that? I don't know what the point of that is. I guess we'll find out. I guess we'll find out. Maybe don't cut anymore. I bet I give them to like sick children and they, they like they like go, Oh, Chibi Robo, thank you so much because you gave me this flower. Now my disease is cured and here's a billion happy points and a million dollars. I bet that's what's going to happen. I bet that's what's going to happen. Either that or I get rid of like the cheapo flowers so I like make room for rare ones. Cause I got I just got two golds out of that. It's so you can eat them. Bubes, have you played this game before? Have you have you have you have you played Chibi Robo Park Patrol? Maybe you can replant them. I should try that. I should try to see if I can replant them. I'm also taking a huge risk here. I'm taking a huge risk. Hugest risk. Hugest risk. Huge risk. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. X drone. Have a good rest of your night. I bet it's so that way you can unlock the suplex. That's right. Of course. Yes. The suplex move. Yes. Of course. Y'all remember the suplex move? Yeah. From Chibi Robo. Yeah. Of course. Of course, yes, the suplex.
go right after leaving the chibi. Oh, that's right. There's a house over there. I remember seeing that. Okay, okay. Maybe I can like put my put my things on the store window and like sell it. Maybe. Let's see how many flowers you have planted. This would have been better on any other Nintendo console. I mean, you know, it was on the go. Imagine this was a chibi robo game. You could play in your grandma's basement. You couldn't play the last Chibi Robo game in your grandma's basement. She doesn't have power down there. She doesn't even have a light down there. All that's down there are the skeletons of the people that she's killed. And, like, you wouldn't have been able to play the original Chibi Robo there. So, when you go down there, or rather when you're forced to, and, uh, you know, to clean up the bodies, you're able to, like, have a little time to play some Chibi Robo. Isn't that nice? Oh, there's, there's a hole in... <gasps> okay. Will I die? What does that mean? What does that mean? Chibi Robo, are you an idiot? Don't cross the freaking road, dude! When the signal turns green, that's your cue to go. I seriously have to wait? <laughs> okay, you know, I, I, need, I need to, you know, learn to be good. Cross the street. Oh, wow, you're, I'm actually crossing the street. If that kid got hit by the car, that would be insane. That would have been insane. Today. Okay, I think there's a flower shop here so we can sell the flowers that we make. Isn't that cute? Everyone is so slow. <laughs> I know they're trying to make them seem big, but they're so slow. <laughs> Welcome to our brand new flower shop. Get to buy some flowers today. Oh, but sigh. If only I had a cute chibi robo that would give me stock for my display. That would have to be something to do with the report on TV. According to the report, flowers are disappearing at an alarming rate. Of course, this is terrible news for my shop. Flower donations are only things keeping me in business right now. If only there was a flower shop across the street. If only there was a flower producing plant right over there. Green flowers. Oh, so like, I bet you get more money for the flowers of the day. I bet that's how it works. I love Queen Sweep, but this is a nice change of pace. Yeah, I'd let you see another side to Mr. Chibi. Ahem. How was it going, my little metal friend? Oh, oh what I meant was... Ah, uh, well, look who it is. It's the world-famous Chibi Robo. Would you like to hear about the Flower of the Day program? I would love to hear about the Flower of the Day. <laughs> well, every day I look for flowers in a specific color. So if someone gives me a flower of that color, it triples my happiness. The flower changes each day to a certain color. Anyway, all that aside, how's that bark coming along? Do you have any flowers for me? I do have some flowers for you. Yes. That's great news. I've just run out of flowers myself. I would be I would be amazed if they ended this game with the with the start of Chibi Robo 3 where like it's Chibi Robo sitting in a field, everything's exploded and there's no life left. Cuz they never explained that in the third Chibi Robo game, did they? They never explained that at all. Do you remember that? And so what happened was, is that, in, ca in case you didn't know, Chibi Robo 2 starts with, or Chibi Robo 3, starts with, everything's gone, the world's destroyed, there is one plug left in the world, and you try to get to it, and boop, you can't get to it, and you die. And then you wake up in, like, the real world again. And then what happens is, is when you're possessed by the giant ghost, he shows you that, that, that vision again. But they never explained what in the world that was. They never explained it. So my hope is that they will explain it in this game. Maybe, maybe it was a reference to like the end of this game. That would be so cool. Come on, 61, that's a passing grade. That's a passing grade. We'll just have to see. No spoilers. Did any of the flowers go over here? Yes, they did. 
Also, I just got a ton of happiness points from cutting those flowers out. Oh, that one has a cute little rainbow! How much are these worth? How much are those? I guess... Okay, how much you want to bet that the rainbow ones are all the colors? Are all the possible colors? So there's green on some of them. I think this one has green, maybe? And so that counts as, like, the color of the day. That's probably what it is. Chibi Robo could use a new game. I know. I would love it. Maybe he just needs to be on the back burner. I think after Ziplash, I think I think he needs a little rest. Cause they really pushed Chibi Robo in the 3DS. They put him in it put him in everything. He got his own amiibo. He got freaking uh He got like a street pass hat, a street pass outfit, trophies in the in the in the Smash games. You know what I mean? And like They uh they gave him some love. Just didn't work out. Imagine Chibi Robo and Switch. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I would be over the moon with the Chibi Robo remake for Switch. Whoa! That's so much. Alright, we're gonna be able to afford that battery, no problem. I just need to get uh I just need to get like a hundred and something more. Oh yeah, he even had his own street pass. I think he had like multiple street pass puzzles. And he had a multiple 3DS themes too. It was so good. It was so good. You should prioritize donating the rainbow flowers. I can do that. I can do that 100%. I can't believe that Ziplash was nine years ago. That's, that's crazy. Nine years. And people... How many more years do you think it'll take before people go like, Oh, Ziplash was actually a pretty good game. It always happens. There isn't a single video game out there. That that has not happened to. Not a single one. It's gonna happen. It just might take a long time. It might take... It might take a long time. But it's gonna happen one of these days. Alright, I'm gonna grab all the, like, rainbow flowers that I can find. I didn't mean to do that. But that's okay. I remember playing the Ziplash demo as a kid, and I was obsessed with it. See, that's the thing. That's the thing. There's going to be a whole generation of Ziplash lovers. It's going to be a whole... Just like there's going to be a whole generation of people who love the Star Wars episodes 7, 8, 9. There's going to be a whole generation of people who are like, Dude... Frick, frick, freaking Twitter, stupid. I can't believe that they said that Ziplash sucked. It was, I love that game. That's what's going to happen, 100%. And I wasn't saying that in that voice to make fun of them. That's just what they're going to sound like when you get to be my age, which is, I'm like 70 right now. It's just something that happens to your voice as you get older. I've even seen people that say that Atari's E.T. is not that bad once you know how to play it. I've seen people say that. If E.T. on the Atari 2600 can get that kind of love, it's gonna, it, one day it's going to happen. One day. Don't step on me. E.T.'s nuts. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. How much, how much, how much money am I going to get out of you? Him. Well, look who it is, the world-famous Chibi Robo. The park's coming along great, and I do have some flowers for you. Now, here's my problem. Uh, am I going to have too many happiness points that's going to, like, overflow the battery? Or are they going to be nice and, like, let me save things? <gasps> Rainbow flowers are hard to come by. I have seven. Oh, thanks a lot, Chibi Robo. Give me a thousand. Give me a thousand. Give me a thousand. <gasps> Holy crap! Holy crap! Holy crap! Okay, that's a lot. There's a whole city here. There's a whole city. I wonder what I can do here. So, uh, I think I can afford the battery no problem now. I think everything's gonna be A-OK. -okay. That game actually wasn't even that bad. Exactly. Exactly. It's gonna happen. And when that happens, it's gonna be a day we can all finally rest. We can all finally rest. Because I remember, I remember when Chibi Robo Photo Finder came out, people were like, this game sucks. It's stupid. I remember. I remember hearing people say that. And now people go, oh, dude, Photo Finder was such a, such a nice game. What a, what, a, what a nice game. I've seen it. I've seen it happen. 
There is never a video game that's hated forever. Not one. Not one video game that's hated forever. It did suck, lol. If you say such a thing in my chat room, he stole all of my happiness points. Oh no. That's gonna overflow the battery. <gasps> oh, never mind. Oh, never mind. Oh, I think I'm good. <laughs> I think I'm good, bro. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Holy crap. It's not stopping. Wow. Okay. So 11,000. That's a good amount of battery. That's pretty good. <laughs> And I think I beat the game. I think I won. <laughs> what do you mean, oh dear? It's because I sold them for profit. And now it's time to buy that nice big battery. I'm working down those Sipskis. I'm working them down. We're down to like 26. I'm good. I'm good. I'm going to make... I'm, I'm not going to stay in debt. I'm not going to stay in Sipski debt. We're not doing that. I never forget about my debts. I always pay them off eventually. Always. Now, what are like park projects? I guess I haven't unlocked them now. I haven't, I haven't unlocked them yet. Oh! <gasps> The 150 watt battery boosts battery capacity. Nice. Now I can go so much further. Do you think the world runs out of flowers because you sell them all? <laughs> See, that's the thing they didn't tell. Uh, Citrusoft didn't tell anyone that. That, like, Chibi Robos are making the flowers to sell them. There's no point in me doing this. The night's about to finish. Let's just take a moment to enjoy the beauty and majesty. It's actually kind of relaxing. It's actually kind of nice. Oh! <laughs> okay, it, it, it was kind of nice. It was kind of nice. Brutch. <laughs> Okay, the black flowers, I think, are the rarest ones. It says 38? I don't know. Is that 38 seedlings? I love the crickets. Crickets are something that's like, I don't like bugs, but like the sound of crickets and stuff like that, I kind of like it. You had one visitor in your park. That means you get one point. Yippee. <laughs> Those spiffy park projects are sure to be crowd pleasers. Keep up the good work, and soon you won't be able to keep the visitors away. You can do it, Chibi Robo. Well, it'll mostly be you, but I'll be rooting for you. You know, I just realized something. So does that mean the guests only come to the park during the middle of the night? That's it. That's that's that, that's the only time that there are guests in the park. Okay, when is the next item? Okay, so it's saying that there are no more items scheduled to arrive until like the story progresses. So I guess I have to wait a few days before like the story is gonna progress. I like how the flowers have creature faces and it's never explained. Like, are they alive? Are they suffering when I rip them out of the ground? That's the question that will never be answered. It will never be answered. All right, let's get more profits. I mean, like, I don't really, I don't really need to, I don't really need to, oh, I didn't mean to do that, I'm sorry. I don't really need to sell any of these things because uh, I've got enough happy points to last me forever. I swear that's like incredibly difficult. That's like, that's like, I, I can imagine being a kid and getting so frustrated I like cry. I, I can imagine that being a thing where it's like, I can't get, I can't get the thing to work with the, with the music. <laughs> that would have been me. That would have been me 100%. If you want my advice, you should only donate the rainbow flowers. Yeah, because we need to have flowers in order to uh, have a 
you know, gather part guests, get new items. Oh, you get rid of holes by squirting it with water. Good to know. I guess that, that keeps the park all nice and beautiful. Did I... Congratulations? <gasps> Ooh, pretty. Now I can see why it's Walmart themed. Now, now I understand why it's Walmart themed. Because Walmart takes care of the environment. And they're 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 beautiful, perfect company. Now it all makes sense. And they sell grass. <laughs> they sell grass. That's that's official Walmart grass if I've ever seen it. Am I killing the flowers? Some of those flowers just they didn't like live. They didn't live. Okay. I assume best course of action to do right now is just try to get as many flowers as possible. My only concern is can I get more? Can I get more from like other things in town or is that just the thing? Like it's just the flower garden, that's it. Are there more shops that I can sell things to? Can I sell grass? Can I sell them dirt? Oh, this is this is the premium dirt. I actually I swear to you, we drive by this like dirt place and only thing they do is sell dirt and uh they have a sign out there that's like oh we only sell the most premium dirt for all of your dirt needs and then and then i don't okay this is something this is a little pet peeve of mine this is a little pet peeve from little, little andrew but there is a thing on that sign that says hey save money make your own food in your garden Plant your own food. That's what it says. I can't imagine it being... To buy an onion, it's like 15 cents. But to buy, like, the dirt and the seeds and take care of it and all that stuff, I feel like that would cost more than 15 cents. But they keep trying to be like, Oh, dude, no, no, dude. You're going to save so much money if you grow your own onions. If you grow your own, if you grow your own apples, you're going to save so much money. But you would produce more over time. But then when they go bad by the time, like, if you're growing onions, right? You're growing like 20 onions at a time. They're going to go bad before you can eat 20 onions. I mean, I know some people do eat onions like apples. They scare me, but I do know that is a thing. Bro, you're getting those cheap onions. Why, why, how, yeah, I get those cheap onions. You could sell them. Now, hold on a second. I didn't think about that. I didn't think about that. That's how you that's that's how you make your money. That's your scam. You then you go to the 7-Eleven with a bag like like a Kroger bag of onions and go, "Hey, bro, onions 10 cents. Onions, come on, take one. Onions 10 cents, man. 10 cents on the dollar onions." I eat onions in one bite. Man, my family just loves onions. I just... Man, ooh, rainbow! I just can't imagine, like, eating an onion that hasn't been, like, prepared as, like, part of a dish. Just, like... Mm. Ooh, that's my number! I swear I did it. I swear I swear I did it. Let's see. One, 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 one. For some reason, it's so much easier to like look at it than it is to like do it by sound. Oh, I don't know. I'm starting to lose my voice. It seriously feels like Friday today. <clears throat> it has been such a long week. I feel like I feel like I'm losing my voice. I feel like I'm losing my my body. I'm I'm, I'm having an out of body experience. <clears throat> What are you supposed to be doing during the dance? You're just like, you're supposed to rotate it at a constant rate. That's what you're supposed to be doing. Okay, folks, I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm refunding, I am refunding 25 Sipskis because I don't have enough water. So enjoy getting your points back. Enjoy getting your, po chicken. <laughs>
piece of chicken. I don't want to be peeing all night. I drank over 100, over 100 Sipskis in one stream. Aw, oh, thank God I got my 150 points back. <laughs> you know, a lot of people would love that. Now here, here's here's the thing, and I'll, I can keep you updated on this if you if you care about my pee reports. I can let you know if I actually pee, because if you don't, then that means you are like severely dehydrated, right? Isn't that like how that works? I don't actually know. It's like, does your body? Okay, this this is gonna sound stupid, but I'm I'm just trying to I'm just I'm just asking a simple question here, just just a little simple question here. Do you? When you drink water, when you when you when you sip down some water, does the water always come out? Or does it get like absorbed into the body? I know it's a stupid question that like a two year old would ask. But it's a, it's I've just I'm just asking a real question. There aren't any there aren't any white flowers anymore. They're all gone. So I can't get any more seeds then. I can't get I can't get any more seeds then. As in, like, if you drink one cup of water, will one cup of water come out? Is is that is that how that works? They're extinct now. I accidentally made the flowers completely extinct and I broke the game. <clears throat> water goes through your bloodstream and then it gets filtered out. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. I'm, I'm learning. I'm learning stuff. Biology would have answered that. Yeah, well, I didn't pay attention. I didn't, I didn't pay no attention to biology. If you had listened, you would have known. Well, I'm going to have you know, nothing in my life, nothing in my life has been a, a detriment because I didn't know. I guess this is the detriment, is embarrassing myself. Embarrassing myself in front of everyone. Biology stream when? You know, when I was in college, I thought about doing a homework stream. That was like some people during college, they were trying to find, like, side hustles to be able to, like, get some cash. So they were, like, so some people I knew would do homework streams where they would, like, stream while doing their homework to, like, get donations. But I don't think anyone watched. <laughs> so I don't, I think they all stopped. I think they all stopped. I don't think anyone, uh, I don't think a lot of people really enjoy <laughs> Watching, watching uh, someone doing their homework. I don't know. Maybe, maybe you would. Maybe you would. But they tried. They tried. And that's, you know, let me tell you what. That's all you can ask of someone. Just trying. The amount of times you've asked a biology question is almost double digits. <laughs> it's been a huge detriment to my life. I want to see if, like, I can go into any of these other buildings. See if there's any cool, cool little extra areas. Like the, like the fast food joints. Yep. <laughs> well, look who it is. That's so relaxing. Just, like, that voice is so relaxing. Go ahead and walk around town. I will. You know what? I will. That was the last white flower in existence. I hope you enjoy it, man. There is none left in the world. That might be the... I got one point. Oh, no, four. I'll take it. Oh, wait. Five. Okay, so there's like a fast food joint here. That's me when I walk. <laughs> that's, that, dude, that's exactly how I walk. I'm just so tall. I've just got such long legs. Oh, that was a good cutscene. No... For what? No Rami. No Rami. No raw meat. No raw meat. So uh what's this one all about? I can't like I can't like see anything. Your torso also leans back when you are. Yeah, it's a problem. Actually I got a massage for the first time ever. Like a professional massage from like it's like a family friend kind of thing. It's not like like a like an actual business something like that. But um I'm going to tell you right now, it was it was it was incredible and apparently I have puffy skin. Dude, is that tomato guy? Is that the tomato guy? He's dead. He's dead.
He's dead. He's not moving. Why isn't he moving? Yeah, no, no. She, she when she was working on my like shoulder, she's like, "Your shoulders are so puffy." I'm like, thank um, um, thank you. Yeah, it's so puffy. So she like had to work the puffiness out, so I would become receptive to the massage. Well, whatever it was, my shoulders have never felt. I mean, they they feel tense now, but they had never felt so wonderful. I need a massage now for weeks. I threw out my shoulder last week. I hurt my shoulder on a ride, and it helps so much. Oh, hi, Chibi Robo. You need moolah to buy the food in here. Sorry, little guy. Oops. I better get back to work on my manager. Would you? That's not. That's not her, is it? There's no way. That's not. That's not. Uh, whatever her name is. That like almost looks like him. You know what I mean? It like almost looks like ketchup, but not quite. It's got like it's like ketchup with a mask. Who who are you? Yeah, it's it's like the same pants, but not not quite. Yo, man. Who am I? I'm Kid Combo, bro. You ever heard of Monkey Burger? Yeah, sure, yeah, okay. F f tweet, f tweet. Right on. Man, that news makes me want to bust a move. We gotta celebrate this fortuitous meeting, bro. Take this. It's my most prized possession, yo. He talks like uh, Skylar White. From that one. <gasps> Spoon! I can, op I can cut things. I can open things. I can do things. I can m dig up things. That's the words I'm looking for. If you want to see what's buried, you're gonna have to find out for yourself. I guess that's that. Thanks for the boost, bro. Yo, man. You want to ask me something? Dancing one, two, and three. Yeah, sure. Keep your moves fresh by switching up your tunes. When you've got out your boombox, just tap the dance icon to switch songs. You've got seven dance tunes to choose from. If you're one of those cats who dig improv, you can set the tunes to play randomly. That'll keep you on your toes. If you want to learn all seven dances, take a lesson from the master. Come by dance school. I don't, I don't, I don't know if that like learned. I don't, I don't know if I like learned anything. Okay, he'll teach me new dances if I give him burgers. But now I've got like, wow, there's like a lot of different places to go. There's like a lot of different places to go. Oh, the back alleyway, the secret back alleyway. Ah, oh, but I ran out of time. There's like a whole overworld to explore. I had no idea that there was an entire overworld. Oh, <gasps> three visitors, baby. Now that we've got grass, people people can't stay away. It's got a whole city to explore, a park. It's very cute. It's very cute the way that they have like the city laid out and everyone's like, oh, look, it's little Chibi Robo. It's so cute. Alrighty then. So we gotta somehow get Moolah to get a burger, and then I gotta feed the burger to the to the monkey guy. And the monkey guy is gonna teach me the dance moves to grow more flowers. You see what I'm trying you see where I'm getting at? See what I'm getting at? I could go for a burger. I haven't had a burger in a long time. Like a long time. I'm pretty sure it's been like a month. And I just I just wanna know if I can have burger. I we don't have any yet. No confirmed schedule yet. No confirmed kills from Citrusoft yet. A burger making stream would be interesting. I feel like you'll it's someone's just gonna make fun of me the whole time. They're just gonna be like that's not how you make a burger, Andrew. Did you seriously put the cheese on? Uh, before the, the the bun? Actually that would be a little weird if I if I put the cheese on after I put the bun on. Like, I, like, put the cheese on top of the bun. Hey, no, but that might be good. It might be good. It might be delicious. So I don't know what to do without yellow f or white flowers. Maybe this thing will turn into a white flower, and then, and then I can, like, do that. Nope. Okay, forgot I said that. No, I would never. I would, I would never do that. No, no, bro. I would never do that, man. That would be so... So disrespectful.
Why did you make that sound effect? I, I didn't even know I made a sound. I, did, I, actually, I actually didn't even think I talked. I completely forgot. Krabby Patties look gross. I'm gonna miss it right now. Krabby Patties just look gross. I don't want a Krabby Patty. I'm gonna try playing music next to these because I feel like I feel like they should do something, right? How do I how do I change the the songs? That's the virtual console menu. How do I change the songs? Whoa! So I've got Showboat, Hoedown, Snake, and Popstar. I have no chips and I have no friends. How do I how do I change my uh, Oh, there it is. Let's try Showboat. How do I how do I how do I do so good and then so bad? But I do perfect anytime that See, well yeah, it doesn't do anything. What's hoe down? Yeah, it doesn't do anything either. Snake. Well, I'm doing fantastic anyway. I'm doing absolutely fantastic, even though it's not doing anything at all whatsoever. I'm just jamming, bro. I'm just jamming. A Krabby Patty is not healthy for you. Well, you know that uh, according to the SpongeBob lore, it doesn't mean that it's good for you. It's good for your soul. Chibi Robo's doing Fortnite dances. You know, Chibi Robo would be great in Fortnite. I'm just gonna say that right now. Has there already been like new Fortnite characters that I need to be aware of? I haven't heard like anything about Fortnite since Peter Griffin. And usually I would hear like, oh, I can't believe they added blah, blah, blah. But I, uh, I haven't heard anything. Not that I particularly care. <laughs> And that, not that I, you know, I'm asking out of like, oh, dude, I want to stream it again so bad. Just, just question. Persona 3. Oh, they're adding Persona 3? They're adding Persona 3. Did you see the Lego that leaked? The Super Mario World Lego that you crank the handle, SpongeBob? You crank that handle and it turns into a... Uh, it turns into like Yoshi opening his mouth and like putting out its tongue and stuff like that. It's actually it's, it's actually kind of sick. It's kind of sick. But I'm pretty sure it'll cost like a hundred two hundred dollars. <laughs> it's gonna be crazy. I uh I was really thinking about getting the uh, the the Super Mario 64 question mark block one, but uh, I decided against it. And now they're never making it again. And that thing's going to be worth an insane amount of money now. So, I guess I guess I just need to make sure I don't ever want it, ever. You should find out what happens if you cross the street before you're supposed to. I bet he's going to just be like, Oh, Chibi Robo, don't do that, you stupid idiot. I bet that's what's going to happen. Or maybe it'll let me get hit by the car. Oh, this... How do I, how do I get into the dang TV? I want, I want to go to the TV shop. I guess there's no way. No, get run over, do it. Fine. We'll do it. Where am I? I don't know where I am. Guys, I'm scared. I don't know where I am. I don't know where to go. There we go. <gasps> okay. Oh! He's fine. No, don't worry about it. He's fine. He's cool. He's fine. He's no problem whatsoever. He's made of that special metal alloy that can survive uh, getting crushed by a 14-ton car. See, the truth is actually Chibi Robo was completely dead, and uh, he he respawned as a new Chibi Robo. He's a different Chibi Robo now. Chibi Robo is dead. Creepy pasta. Official creepy pasta. Okay, I gotta figure out what's like going on back here. Cause I can't afford I can't afford a burger with my salary. No, thank you. I can't afford food. So let's see, let's see how far we can get back here. So this is where this is where the exploration 
You know, it's relying entirely off of how much battery power I have. You know, this reminds me of Fortnite, that one video game that I made a long time ago. This was, that was kind of the thing where it was like the, the distance you could travel in the world changed depending on, uh, you know, on how long you had played the game for. What is, what is even around here? Is this just for fun? Just, just for quirky fun? Chibi Robo, do you copy? Oh, Chibi Robo, that's a manhole. You can hop in there if you have something to protect you from the water. Ah, shoot. Now we don't got anything yet. So that's where I need to go once I get some kind of like water suit. <clears throat> also, I did not have to go through there. I could have just gone all the way around and it would have been fun. I like this music though. This is the kind of music that would be on like the, the late night, like you're alone in your house, Nintendo music playlist. Yeah, you need an umbrella. An umbrella helps you swim more. Man, my voice is not not going so hot right now. <clears throat> it's fine, Andrew. You only got 20 minutes left. <clears throat> you can make it. I believe in you, me. But my question is, is like, what do I do about like the fact that I can't make any more flowers? Like, what 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 do I do about that? I can't I can't make any more flowers. They're all, they're all like different colors now. Unless I'm like fundamentally misunderstanding how this game works, which that's impossible. Jeez, this park is huge. This park's gigantic. Maybe there's more flowers like the further down you go. Actually, wait, there's like a flower button right here. Okay. Flower, here's, okay, there's flower petals. So yeah, there's, I have to like go to the next like flower place and do that. That's what I have to do. Except there's no way I can cross this, is there? Yeah, I can't cross that. So I have to go to this one that's across the pond there. <gasps> Wait, that's a flower. That's a little flower. Hello. Oh. Hello there, little one. Oh, it died. That's fine. How do we... Re oh, yeah, I don't even have the bridge. I can't repair the... That's a ton. There's like a car back there. It's like a freaking car. It would take Chibi an entire day to walk all the way across the park. Here, let me, uh... Someone said check the map again. So I can't get through there. I can't get through there. I can't get through there. So yeah, I can't do anything right now. I have done, I've done the maximum of what I can, I can do. So I guess I'm just waiting for the story to progress. Maybe there's like a, a park project in the chibi house that I need to see. The park doesn't look a whole lot like a park. Well, it will when I when I'm done with it. It's gonna look so beautiful. No, I can't. I don't have any park projects. There's stickers in the game. Flowers everywhere. Mm, oh, Kudasai. Your park looks no fun. Well, you know that's that's really that's really mean. That's really mean. I had three whole visitors recently. Just saying. Three whole visitors. I guess we'll wait for this day to, to progress. Check the map again. Check the flower button again. You missed a flower. Let's see. So these are the buds. These are the multicolored ones. So there's the buds on the... On that thing we can't get to. Because... It will be destroyed by the end of the day because they, it, it's on sand. And if it's on sand, it doesn't count. And for some reason, these things die. Yeah, those things just die. I guess, it's, is it just mean there's like a maximum amount of flowers here? Oh, maybe that one would have grown. Maybe that one would have grown. Time to head on back, chibi bro. I think it's just waiting for the story to progress before I can do it. I think I wasn't supposed to get that many points that fast. Good morning, Chibi. You had four whole visitors in the park. Very nice. Yippee, yippee. Chibi Brobo. That's what they should have called the Kickstarter thing. They're calling it like Co-Robo. 
They should have called it Chibi Bro Bo. That would have made so much more sense. That would that just would have made so much more sense. I have so many things. So many things. Let me check when the next schedule is arrived. Yeah, it says there's no confirmed schedule, which means that I have the maximum amount of flowers that I can get. What do you what do you what are you waiting on? Maybe maybe I can like talk to him and he'll tell me. Maybe he'll he'll be nice. Excuse me. Excuse me, friend. Hello? Oh! I almost forgot! When you raise lots of flowers in a given era, the land transforms into a green space. When that happens, white flowers transform into colored flowers and flower buds turn into happy points instead. Talk about happiness. When the entire park is made up of green spaces, well, I won't ruin it for you. You'll just have to see it for yourself. Oh, I accidentally tapped again. Your watt consumption changes depending on the surface that you're standing on. Let's say you're standing on soil. You'll consume more watts because it's more difficult to move around. And on hard surfaces, you'll consume less watts because it's easier. So here's a little tip from your pal Chet. Walk on hard surfaces like paths to maximize battery life. Well, these are like, these aren't like little tips. These are like important. It's important. When you tap the map icon, you'll switch to a bird's eye view. Let me tell you, it's pretty neat. Check the map to see the surroundings and the flower buds and the chibi house. Pretty nifty. What would you like to hear about? Oh, I, I guess that's everything. I know you're probably gonna work hard, but you should play hard too. I don't think there's anything more that I can buy. I don't think there's anything more that I can buy. So I guess I want. I want to cut the. I want to cut the weeds out of my dang park. That's what I want. I want to get these weeds out of my park. Can I do that? Get out of here. No, you can't do that. So I guess my question is, what do I what do I do? Because it's saying that once the things turn green, there's nothing that you can do. Maybe what I have to do is I have to walk over to this, and then it'll be like it'll trigger something. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, it'll trigger something. That's what I had to do the whole time. Chibi Robo, do you copy? <gasps> it's a bicycle. Get a load of this. It's a toy bike over there. Oh. Oh, right, 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 right. I almost forgot. You need to do this in order to play the game. But not to worry. If we access park projects, we can fix the bridge. Ahem. I'm preparing it as we speak. Just leave it to me. Yeah, so I had to just walk over here to continue the game. You know, in, in their defense, it is a gigantic thing that's right in your view at all times. You could have done that so much, but I wouldn't have been able to discover Burger Monkey, Monkey Burger or whatever his name is. I wouldn't have been able to discover my new best friend. He hasn't finished. <laughs> he hasn't finished setting it up. I have to wait. I have to wait till the end of the day, I guess. We love Monkey. Everyone loves monkeys. Why don't we just take a moment and enjoy the park, I guess. Actually, wait, no, we have a rainbow flower. Let's take that and, like, sell it while well, we, well, we got the opportunity. And then and then I need, to, I need to squirt this thing. I want my park to be perfect. My park needs to be perfect. Chet has to install the new firmware feature. Oh, so that one actually turned into a flower. So sometimes they actually turn into a flower. Other times they just give you happiness points instead. I'm discovering how this game works. I'm learning. See, I could use my brain space, my limited brain space, to learn about dumb things like biology. I choose to learn about cool things like Chibi Robo. Things that actually matter. Link had said the text, oh, I get it, which makes me think that that I'm about to figure out what to do. I'm actually going to figure out how this game works. There's a maximum number of flowers per flower bed. Okay, so once you reach the maximum, you need to rip out the flowers so that way you can grow more. That's what it is. So I'm about to just steal every single flower in this flower bed real quick. Eh. Goodbye, flowers. It's been nice knowing you. 
So now I'm gonna go and get a ton of money. So there's a maximum amount of flowers per flower bed. Then throughout time, they have like little flower buds will pop up in the flower beds that already have like grass in them. So that way, I'll be able to to maximize profits. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I can run. I can. I can outrun. I can outrun him. I can outrun him. Don't steal all of them though. Oh, because you'll lose. Oh, it's a red day. Holy crap! And I've got a ton of red flowers. Holy crap! So I guess if I get rid of all the flowers, then it loses the grass, and then it ruins everything. Dude, how lucky am I? Oh, look who it is. Where do I, like, recognize that voice from? The oodi oodi abba. Oodi oodi I recognize that voice from something. Like a different game. Like a completely different game. Oh, I'm so pleased. Oh, beautiful. Everyone loves beautiful red flowers. I swear this from... Earthbound? <laughs> I don't know. For some reason, I feel like it's from Earthbound, but... Oh, no, it reminds me of from Mother 3, the Okadiska. That sound, the Okadiska. The sound that plays when you enter your name in Mother 3. It reminds me of that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Give me all those happiness points. Yeah, today's a pretty happy day. So I just might as well go back and, like... Grab as many of those red flowers as I can without ruining the entire thing. Okay, Disco. I still need to play Mother 3. I still need to. I don't think they'll ever translate the original game, but I swear some, one day they'll make a Mother 3 remake. We don't know if there's ever going to be another Nintendo Direct before the Switch 2, do we? We, we don't know at all, I don't think. <clears throat> I think we're just kind of up in the air whether or not we'll get another one. What about Banjo-Kazooie? I don't think we're ever going to get another Banjo-Kazooie game ever again for the rest of our lives. They might jump scare us on Twitter. Yeah, that's true. They could just shadow drop it on Twitter. Mother 3 is like one of my favorite games ever. A lot of people have said that. It's amazing like how many like games that never released in America are like Americans' favorites. It's like it's like a certified American classic. Like uh like Chibi Robo Clean Sweep is one of my favorite games of all time. Mother 3 is a lot of people's favorite games. So like I feel like I feel like uh I don't know. It just feels like a ripe opportunity. I mean we're getting we're getting Gyakuten Kenji 2. We're getting Gyakuten Kenji. We're getting Miles Edgeworth Investigations 2 English translation, which no one thought was going to happen. That game came out on the DS and never released in America. You got you got you got to think of it that way. Chibi Robo Clean Sweep came out at the same time as Miles Edgeworth Investigations 2. Both Japanese exclusives and just now all these years later, we're finally getting Miles Edgeworth Investigation 2 translated in English, officially. Like, it's never too late. It's never too late to believe. And with a tiny bit of magic, all your dreams will come true. That's what, that's what SpongeBob taught me. That's what SpongeBob taught me. We didn't get the translation for the Starfy games. Technically, that is true. But you did get the Starfy games, I guess. You did get them. It is kind of interesting how, like, the Starfy games they put on... Oh, yeah, sorry. I, 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 I ruined, like, the park. Oh, that's, that's my bad. Oopsie. But, you know, what are you going to do? It is kind of strange how, like, the Starfy games released on the American Game Boy Advance Switch Online, but not Mother 3. That was, that was, that is kind of strange. I don't know why. <clears throat> Cause like, well, I guess because Starfy's a platformer, right? And like Mother 3 is more of like a, a text-based RPG. Maybe it's not that strange. Maybe maybe it does make sense. Because Starfy, you're just kind of jumping around, doing things like that. So like, if you can't read it, it's not like the end of the world. But if you can't read Mother 3, I feel like that's going to like kind of ruin things. I feel like you would get a lesser experience. That would make sense. Him. How's it going, my little metal friend? Oh, what I meant was, 
Well, look who it is. World famous GB Robo. Starfy does have a lot of character interactions, but the reading is not integral to the core gameplay. Yeah, that's that's got to be the reason then. Now, I can't forget. I cannot wait for the Bubsy Perfect Collection on Steam. That's going to be the biggest game release of the year, guaranteed. I don't even remember when it comes out. <laughs> Does anyone remember when it comes out? Any Anyone at all remember? Oh, cute. So he's actually getting like little flowers in his shop now. So we're like, we're like building up the shop. It released right now. No. No, it didn't. Mm -mm. Not possible. It's not possible. Mm -mm. That guy ran into me. What a jerk. What a freaking jerk. It releases tomorrow. Oh, okay. Okay. Are you sure about that? <laughs> I'm going to pull it up. Now, now that you're making me question, I'm going to pull it up. Now, 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 there's no way. I think it comes out next year. I'm pretty sure it comes out next year. I would love you to convert my happy points. Thank you for asking. October 13th. I don't know if I believe you. For some reason, I just feel like I shouldn't. So I'm just going to figure it out myself. The perfect collection releases in 2025. Just sometime in 2025. That's insane. That is that is an insane wait. For Bubsy. <laughs> I mean, they're remaking all the games, you know, so... It is what it is. It's gonna be. It's gonna be the most amazing, incredible gaming experience of our of our natural lives. It's kind of interesting, though. I don't think, I don't think they're doing the fractured furry tales, though. The Atari Jaguar one. I think they're doing every single game in that collection except for the Atari Jaguar one. I don't know if it's like a weird rights to the thing. I don't know what it is, or maybe it's because it sucked. That one was by far the worst one, in my opinion. But, um, I don't know. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Are you going to stream it? I technically have already streamed it, but maybe I'd do it for like a variety game night kind of thing. Maybe it's like, oh, variety game night, you know, let's all try out the new Bubsy collection. Instead of dedicating an entire, you know, two full hours to playing games that I already played on stream. But I'm going to tell you right now, I am. Don't get me wrong, very, very excited. This is a good, like, stream outro. Oh, that's me. Hi. That's that's embarrassing. Boo. Got you. Got you. Where did my stylus go? Oh, there it is. I know. There's a lot of outros I still need to do. There's a lot of outros. You wouldn't believe it. <laughs> I'm busy. Who would have who who freaking guessed? Who would have freaking guessed? It is kind of nice, though. So, so the Chibi Robo Clean Sweep, you had to use the touch screen to move. It is kind of nice to use the like this because I don't have to look. I don't have to like look at the at the gamepad. It's like totally fine just looking at the TV. The TV, the monitor. Good job. Let's come back. I need to like get a full list of like every single outro I need to do. I need to get a full list. But I'll figure that out later. <laughs> we'll figure that out later. Now, we can finally repair the bridge. I like to imagine that's the sound it makes. 
I love the Wii U gamepad. It's literally perfect for for DS games. That's the one thing the Switch doesn't have is the ability to like be a good DS game player. But like there is no other game system, not no PC, nothing that can do DS games quite like the Wii U can. Cause I can like show it on the TV, have it for the stream and also do all the touch controls I need. It's nice and crisp. It's perfect. It's, it's just, ah, it's comfortable. It's nice. It's everything to me. It's everything to me. Can I not do the park project still? I thought you said I would leave it to you. I thought you said I should leave it to you. I left it to you, Chet. <laughs> Freaking Chet. He forgot. Freaking Chet forgot. He's gonna be like, oh, sorry, Chibi Robo. Completely forgot that I was supposed to do that. I can walk on it. I thought I thought I could just like walk across it. But it doesn't let you. Chet, what are you doing? He completely forgot to do the one single thing he's supposed to do. The one single thing. I would love it if the Switch successor had like a, a like a nicer multi-touch touchscreen. A like uh, a, a stylus like right inside. A camera microphone. That would be so good. That would be so good. Get rid of Chet. Chet isn't nearly as good as Telly. Telly would always, he would always do everything I needed. Chet was, Chet was always there when we needed him. I'm sorry, I meant Telly. I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm just so frazzled. I'm just so freaking frazzled, man. I like Chet. <gasps> Ooh! I can plant more flowers now. Can't believe 67% is enough. There we go. There we go. I'm going to tell you right now, uh, this is probably where we're going to have to stop. <laughs> this is where we're going to have to stop, which means I'll just have to figure it out next time on Game Grumps. We'll just have to, we'll just have to figure it out. Maybe we'll detect that the DS turned off and it'll be like, Oh, Chibi Robo, thank you for waiting real 24 hours of time. Now you can do the special thing. We don't want you playing it too often now. We don't want you, we don't want you to, to hurt your poor little eyeballs. Maybe that's what it's all about. This is a certified Game Grumps moment. I just want to get, I want to get all my flowers back real quick. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take the big risk. Andrew's gonna take the big risk right now. Okay, that is the maximum amount of flowers then. I've now I've now hit maximum again. Well, actually, there's a, there's a few on this side too that I need to get to. Beta sixty four likes to be a clone of many users. If I can be like Scott the Waz, Game Grumps, uh, what else is popular with the kids? Skibbity Toilet. If I can be all those combined, I can be the ultimate YouTuber, man. I could do it. One of these days, I'm Mr. Beast, uh, uh, LGR sausage guy. That's me. That's me. That's what they call me. Anyway, I would love it. I would absolutely love it if the Switch 2 could play DS games. Because it, it truly would need a hardware revision to be able to play DS games. It would make me so happy. They should just sell a gamepad for the Switch 2. They should just sell another... They should just do it like... like let's just make the Wii U again. Let's just do it again. We'll call it Switch U. Let's do it. I would love to save. Thank you very much. Chet is the secret villain. The, the, I mean, he's not letting me continue the storyline. 
It's up to you to make me explode. What? I didn't read that right. I didn't read that quite right. I I think the Switch 2 is going to go well. I don't think it's going to be another wheel. I think I think it's going to be so exciting and so fun. I, I I have great faith that the Switch 2 is going to is going to be epic. It is definitely one of those I'm picking up on launch day kind of things. Definitely a launch day system. Okay. So Chet definitely said, I, I heard it with my own eyes. He definitely said, just leave it to me, Chibi Robo. I'll handle it. He definitely said that, right? I heard that with my eyes. I feel like I just got my Switch. I likely wouldn't get a Switch 2. Well, uh, would it make you feel uh, differently if I told you that the Switch 2 comes with a free Steam game? That's right. They partner with Valve and you get Half-Life Alex for free if you purchase a Switch 2. The Switch 2 is definitely going to be VR 100%. No, it's 100%. No, no, uh, no chance. Anything else? It's like another white flower here. But where is it? Where would it? Where would it grow? Where would it grow more seeds? I feel like I'm at my maximum right now. I think it's insane that they like made a cardboard VR headset for the Switch and like Breath of the Wild had support for it. I think that's insane. And you're gonna see a YouTube video in 20 years is like the Switch had VR. What? You're gonna see that. You're gonna see that for sure. I still love that. I had a Nintendo Labo and I was gonna build it on stream. I was gonna do it and I never, I never did it. I never had the guts to do it. It just, uh, I don't know what it was. I was told it took like four to five hours to like set it up and I was just like, ah, I'm not gonna do that. And it was like, it cost me like $70. It was like $70. So I, uh, I just took it back. I bet it's really hard to find them now, isn't it? I bet it is. Cause like, I sold them at Target for like ten bucks for a, for a long while, and now I don't see them anymore. I don't I don't see them anymore anywhere. So I can almost guarantee you, they're probably worth a ton of money. You know what? Let's let's see. Let's see. Let's see how much, how much is Nintendo Labo worth these days? I'm pulling up good old fashioned eBay. Let's see. Uh, 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 Labo VR. Let's just just see Labo VR. Oh, it's actually, it's not worth it. It's it's actually okay. <clears throat> well, okay. No, no, no. You can get a you can get the VR kit. It's like sixty bucks. So basically, it's basically you're paying full price again. So it has gotten more expensive. The thing about Labo that's kind of insane if you think about it. Those things are only going to get more valuable because when you play them, you can't build it again. You know what I mean? There is a limited amount in the entire world. And it's only going to get more and more rare as time goes on to find like a brand new one in box. You know what I mean? I think I think it's kind of insane to think about that 40 years from now is going to cost like a thousand bucks. What's happening? What's happening? Story? Oh, uh, um, uh, Chibi, if you want to fix that bridge over there, well, that actually falls under the park project heading, and it's ready to go and all, but, um, I need a cartridge in order to get it all started, and, uh, I just, you just put in this nifty machine over there to use it, but the, the thing is, um, <clears throat> I lost the... <laughs> Freaking Chet. This is a certified Chet moment. I'm so sorry. But it's all my fault. I'll take full responsibility for this. I must have dropped them on the trip here. <clears throat> I hate to ask you to do this, but uh, Ch Chibi Robo, uh, would you would you go to look for them in, uh, in town for me? I knew you were a good egg, Chibi Robo. 
You're the best. Uh, by the way, did you want to save? Yeah, I'll save. All right, now we know what we're doing next time. We got to go fix Chet's freaking mistakes that he did. I just love, I just love, I don't know why it just randomly played it. Maybe it's because I needed more flowers. Maybe it's because I needed more flowers. I don't know. Well, I'm going to create a restore point just in case it doesn't save, but I don't know why it wouldn't save. All right. That was our first, our first ever part of Chibi Robo Park Patrol. That was really fun, actually. I, I enjoyed that. It's a change of pace for sure from the last game, but... I, I, I think it's cute. I think it's really cute. It feels weird and original, and I feel like I'm kind of digging it. I am I am enjoying myself. So, if you would like to continue the Chibi Robo journey, you're gonna wanna you're gonna wanna click that follow button. Okay, you're definitely um gonna wanna click the follow button. Will you ever stream Chibi Robo Park Patrol? I don't think so. I'm too busy playing Chibi Robo Park Patrol personally. But maybe in the future, I'd be more interested in playing Chibi Robo Park Patrol, like after I beat Chibi Robo Park Patrol. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see about that. I, do, I don't want to make any promises, though. We'll see how I feel after being Chibi Robo Park Patrol. So, we're going to do submit for stream. And I'm not streaming tomorrow. I'm taking, I'm taking tomorrow off to work. To, to work more. But I want you to know that I appreciate you all. And that next week i'm actually at kind of a weird point right now because i want to keep playing super mario sunshine i want to keep playing luigi's mansion 2 and i want to keep playing chibi robo but like i'm running out of streams in the week to like to like do all these games and i don't want to be like i'm just playing luigi's mansion 2 super mario sunshine and chibi robo for the next six months i gotta i gotta i gotta pace myself I gotta still beat yoshi's island i made a vod on the archive channel that says beta 64 Beats Yoshi's Island for the first time. And if I don't actually do it, then I'm a liar. So I don't want to be a liar. That would be that would be bad. And I also want to play the NES like speedrunning game next week, too. Gosh dang. Assuming I, you know, get the package. But we'll see. <laughs> okay. We have uh we have some good stuff from Scott No Last Name and Mega. You'll you'll see what I mean. Why, why I say both names. So this one is from Scott, no last name. This is, uh, so I've been working a lot on my rebrand. And uh, I think it's going really well. If you want to just tell me what you think of, uh, of what, what we're planning here. So I needed to like, I needed to like, you know, update the, the profile picture. So is it good? Lore accurate, Andrew. I need to like move my face. Like I'm, I'm getting my head cut off. Hold on. Let me, let me do a little something, something real quick. Let me just, uh. Just do a little something, something. There we go. That's a, that's a little more comfortable now. Maybe I'll maybe I'll move a little bit more that way. There we go. So that's from Scott. Looking good. Looking very nice. Yeah, that's from Scott. Mega made uh made something similar, but the uh, this one's it's, it, it just says grizzled. <laughs> it just says. It just says grizzled 64. I don't know. I don't know what grizzled means, but uh, I guess I'll find out in just a second. What in the world is? I should have like figured that out before. Having gray hair? That's what grizzled means. If someone has a streak of gray hair. I don't have, I've never heard that word in my life. Do I have, I know I actually have gray hair. I will admit, I will admit. <laughs> okay, okay, hold on, hold on. We got, we got two things. First is from our lovely moderator, Carly, who is just, how, Carly, I just want you to know how appreciated you are. The entire mod team, how much I appreciate you all. You are just an invaluable help and people that I can, I can trust and appreciate that, that help with so many things in Beta 64. With that being said, I don't like this. It just says Andrew is a delicate little flower. But I do want you to know I appreciate you. 
well you are. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm just, I'm just a little delicate little flower, and um. <laughs> okay, this is the last one we'll look at for tonight. Um. My God. This is just from JJ Space Luigi. I really like this a lot. This is me going to my nearest 7-Eleven selling onions <laughs> with pants that are like up to here. They're <laughs> like halfway up my dang body. Hey. Hey, man. Hey. Can I interest you in an onion? Ten cents? Ten cents for an onion? I grew these myself. I grew myself in my backyard. At the They're nice little onions. Nice and golden, you know, you're never gonna find onions like this. Made it in my own soil. I, I made that soil. And I, I I I harvested them and ten cents on the dollar, man. You if you give me a dollar, I'll give you ten cents, you get an onion. <laughs> that took half an hour to make. This image took JJ's face week half an hour. Worth it one hundred percent. Your time was well spent. One hundred percent. All right, that's all we'll do for tonight, but I do want you to know that you, chat, you viewers, you lurkers, you VOD watchers, you are also appreciated. Let's just have an appreciation party. Come on, everyone. Everyone, come on, dance. Dance, dance, dance. It's an appreciation party. I'm so thankful that you chose to spend your Thursday night with me. I won't be streaming tomorrow, which means I will see you again on Tuesday of next week, where we're gonna be doing more fun, haha, -ha funny things. Maybe it'll be a serious stream where all I'll do for two hours straight is stare at you at the camera. Who knows what will be next? But if you're interested, the Discord server has a room where you can see the schedule. I post them on Monday, so that way you can see what I'm going to be streaming for the week. Finally, a silent stream. <laughs> well, I'll, uh, here, here's the deal, folks. We're going to raid Wolfden, who's playing some of that Nintendo World Championship NES edition. And uh, you're never going to freaking believe it. You are never going to believe it. I have to pee. Who would have seen it coming? That's your fault. And I want you to know that. And uh, I'm going to put a stricter limit on that. Well, okay. Maybe I don't need to because the reason why it ended up that crazy was entirely my fault. That really was entirely my fault. I can't blame you. That was my fault. <laughs> all right. I will see you all on Tuesday, okay? Stick around uh, for the raid, and don't forget, if you haven't watched the Andrew64 video, go watch that. And uh, you can check out the Archive channel with all the, the past streams that you may have missed. Farewell, everyone. I'll see you next week. See you on Tuesday. Choo! And next time you see me, I'm going to be super buff because I'm going to do like a Wii Fit run over the weekend, and I'm going to be so buff. Next time you see me, my legs are not going to fit in my pants anymore. Choo! Thank you.